Jop Pow. If he is the head, the way the crown. Okay, family. I, hey, I got a full lecture. I got a full lecture right here. So I need you to subscribe to King Jop Power. I need you to go to the throne of King Jop Power. Subscribe there right now. Okay, right now. Period. Like all videos. Put a like on this video. Share this to the people. Very important information. Now, I'm going to tell y'all right now, you know, it, you know, we got these diaspora wars going on. Okay? And one of the main uh, uh, topics that make uh, black Americans mad is that the Africans be saying that Black Americans ain't got no culture, okay? And, you know, which I agree with, okay? You deny your culture when you deny Africa, period. I don't care who started the diaspora wars, you know, you know, we too old to be up here bickering about who said what first, okay? And so I got a full lecture, y'all. I want y'all to buckle in. You see what I'm saying? And I'm not putting no disclaimer in here either. You see what I'm saying? Because FBA and Weak Nack Measy and different O'Shea Duke Jackson, they think, you know, that they can get up here and just say what they want. That just ain't going to happen. That just ain't going to happen. And to my comrades out there, it shouldn't be, you know, no hour in the day where they ain't feeling the fire of black power. Period. Period. Our own people ain't no part of the day. You know, when my you know, when I'm on, you know, y'all off. When y'all on, I'm off. I'm talking to my comrades, RBG out there. You see what I'm saying? The Garvey Ice out there. You see what I'm saying? Uh uh Black Power out there. You see what I'm saying? Rastafari out there. You see what I'm saying? The comedic community. All of them, when, you know, this is an issue, we must read from the community. They like roaches. You see what I'm saying? We need some raid and shit. You see what I'm saying? Especially this one right here. Now, what kind of Negro is this y'all following with the Uncle Sam hat on? You see what I'm saying? With the Uncle Sam hat on. Now, I'm about to get on these Negroes so don't nobody get mad because it's very important that we... You know, shoot missiles at the fake FBA compound. See, and that, you know, museum that I showed, it don't even exist. That museum that I showed, that fake museum, it don't even exist. That's just a thought in somebody's mind. That would just, you know, the, the illusion that get you to invest your money. You see what I'm saying? So, Goofies like this with a hat on, looking stupid as hell. You see what I'm saying? These is what you don't want to be, okay? Now, let's get into the lecture, family. Like the video, okay? Like the video. We celebrate every holiday, spring break, freak, nick, bite, week, Mardi Gras, uh, Christmas, Thanksgiving, Halloween, Easter, uh, Black History Month, which we, which we supposed to celebrate Black History Month, the Players Ball, Orange Crust, the Rainbow Parade. But in America, we don't celebrate none of our own culture, which is African culture. You see what I'm saying? Which is African culture. So when you deny Africa, thumb up this video. Like the video. When you deny Africa as a black person and, you know, you deny your true culture and heritage. And all, you know, though a lot of the diaspora Africans came from West Africa, all black people don't come from West Africa. Uh, Nat Measy, Mosquito, okay? All blacks don't come, like black white people was going over there saying, oh man, we just gonna, you know, take some Ebos and some Dogons or something. They, they, they take whoever. They didn't respect no tribal, none of that. Okay? They, they didn't respect no none of that. So that's a, 
a weak talking point that I just blew up with a grenade. Okay. And so black people, we over here in America and celebrate everything, you know, but our African heritage and who we truly is. These people done done a number on black people mind of the globe about how we see and how we view Africans and how we view Africa. Okay. Well, you can, that mean you, you know, Africa is, is you standing up in the morning and looking in the mirror. So when you talk about Africa, you talking about self. So that's self hate. Okay. Point blank period. Now, the greatest thing you could teach your child is the knowledge and of self and to think and research for themselves. Okay. And so that's what I'm saying. You know, the knowledge of Africa, you know, is what's going to get us, you know, our mind right. Because once we know who we are, we automatically know what we need to do. You would never know. rights activists or whatnot, you know, being reborn, you know, from the dead or whatnot and coming back with that. You know what I mean? That's not sufficient for the day's children today. The day's children, which I'm going to show, they face it, you know, all kind of, you know, uh, 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 downfalls from each, all kind of traps. They facing all kind of traps, you know, many more even than we had when we was children. And you know how I was. When we was coming up, the guns and the drugs, the killers, the prostitutes, needles and shit all on the, you know, on the floor, glass crack caps and shit all on the, on the bus stop. You know how it was when we was growing up. You see what I'm saying? And, you know, we know from day one that culture, our true culture was stripped from us. Okay? Was stripped from us. And so what FBA is doing is trying to make up a, a culture on the fly. And so we gonna put that t theory to task tonight. Do FBA have a culture? And I'm over here. I, I've been in America my whole life, okay? Other than a few times, you know, that I done traveled, but outside of that, I've been in America my whole life. So I know what it is. You can't lie to me. You ain't over in damn Holland thinking you know something about America. Things evolve in America. Things change by the day, by the minute, by the hour. Okay? That, that, that just facts. And so, whatever you thought America was, that ain't what it is. Okay? Now, let's go. Next slide, please. I celebrate Black History Month every day, B. You see what I'm saying? This ain't a part-time job, you know, for me. It just not. This is how I live it, walk it, breathe it, eat it, sleep it, everything. You see what I'm saying? See, I have no other choice. You see what I'm saying? The the when when real is around, the energy is there. Okay? When the when the real information is around, you can feel it. Okay? And so can other people. So they not gonna block, you know what I mean? That weak uh uh shots the FBA is throwing. Um,
lot of uh, liquor stalls, peer pressure from, from drugs, the fake ass Bible, uh, uh, all money ain't good money, you know, pro brain programming, gangs, uh, heart problems, guns, the preacher, prostitutes, and fake ass Jesus. You see what I'm saying? And them being told that basketball is the only way out to get tough. Okay, so that's some of the same things that we was facing, but today we can recognize it. In order, you know, to stop it, you must be able to recognize it, just like an addict. And, and to, you know, before he be a crash dummy, okay? And so feeding, you know, we just going to stay in America. Well, we just going to stay in America. This is all the shit we facing right here. This is all This is all the shit that the youth going to be facing. You see what I'm saying? So let me see if, you know, Tariq Nasheed, uh, Nat Measy, O'Shea Duke Jackson, uh, Jason Black. Let me see if these fake Negroes uh, uh, empower with ADOS and shit like that. Let me see if these fake people can fix all of these problems in America, okay? This is what you're going to have to do if you're talking about, you know, you know, you know, we just going to stay in America. If people stay in America, they're going to just keep doing the same shit that they've been doing. Your little ass voice or Tariq goddamn voice ain't strong enough to get black people out of this shit. Right too deep. They'll count on one man. I'm going to look, you look five years from now, you know, if y'all follow Tariq, we gonna be in the same damn predicament in the in America. I ain't, I ain't. You see what I'm saying? Neither is my immediate family members either. You see what I'm saying? Neither. You see what I'm saying? It's time to make that linkage with Africa. Now let's go to the next video. When your whole squad don't know shit about history, like I said, this FBA right here, and they fly there faking in the ass. You know, uh, red, white, and blue and shit. And and and, and you listen to the end of the third, second, and third uh, 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 verse and shit of the national anthem. Black people ain't even citizens and shit. And they talking about bombs bursting in the air and shit. They dropping bombs on you. Shit. You ain't fall on Plymouth Rock. Plymouth Rock fell on you. You know what I'm saying? Shout out to El Malik Shabazz. But this right here is the FBA count. This is what they gonna do. Walker, you know how stupid they look in front of the enemy? When the white supremacists see you niggas walking around with their flag on. Okay? No, nah, man, CCC. Uh, uh, we was free after the Civil War. Man, I don't want to hear none of that. You see what I'm saying? Uh, uh, Kwame Toure say we ain't no American nothing. We African. See, that, that kill all the fighting and the diaspora wars and all of that shit. But in order for these Negroes to keep their YouTube money coming, they got to keep these, you know, topics up here. Africans versus the African and shit, which I'm going to do. You see what I'm saying? What, which I'm going to do. Be looking for that video. I already undone them topics, but I guess we got to do it again. These Negroes, I'm going to, you know, obliterate. Okay? So now. Let me click out. Let me go right here. And this is where we want to go. Now. So you look right here. Nat Measy, I want to ask you. Okay. Is this right here the representation of a black man? Now, if you go outside today, this is what they're going to be looking like. Just keep it real with me. Is this, you know, uh, 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 black American culture? Because if this is a black American culture... That ain't, that ain't, that's not culture. That's not, eh, eh, that's not culture. Okay, and this is what the fuck these niggas looking like. Hey, you stepped on my shoes, oh. Stepped on my shoes, oh. Nigga mad as hell. Is this the instruments of black American culture? I'm asking. I'm asking the people out there, is this the instrument of what they saying is black American culture. Because this is the shit we see every day. You see what I'm saying? And if this is what you're talking about as culture, 
That's not culture. A culture is language. You speak the white man language. Dress. You wear the white man clothes. Gucci, Louis Vuitton, Tie, and Tommy Hill figure and shit. You wear their clothes. Okay. Uh 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 uh. Songs. You you I, I'm, which I'm gonna get to in a minute. I hope you ain't talk about hip hop. Is is black American culture, nigga? If that's black American culture, eh, that's not culture either. Okay. Hey, how's your your culture? You see what I'm saying? You know, murdering grandmas and stealing pocketbooks and shit. Nigga, get out of here. Treachery and setting up motherfuckers. And so are these the instruments of what Nat Measy call African American culture. So now let's go. Now, is these, is this, uh, uh, right here, African American culture? I'm asking. Don't nobody get mad. Throw them up this video. Is these young men right here with these guns, is, 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 is they going to shoot, you know, the, the real enemy or is they going to shoot somebody that look like them? I'm asking because you saying that black Americans got a culture. And this is what we seeing outside every day, okay? When you got culture, that mean you know thyself. You we don't have when you got culture, you don't have an identity crisis, okay? You you automatically know who you are, and you belong to a landmass. You don't fly the flag of your damn enemy, okay? I would never put the American flag on my body. You none of that shit. You see what I'm saying? None of that shit. Let known these, these niggas be wearing hats and suits and shit. Red, white, and blue. Now look here. Now, is this black American culture? You see what I'm saying? Or is this, the, you know, you know, representation of black American culture? Because if, if, you know, if, if, if rap is, the, is, is, is black American culture, well, 6 9 is a representative of FBI then. Y'all fly the slang flag, okay? And this is, if, if you saying black Americans got a culture, this is the music. And what are you talking about? He ain't even black and talking about shooting black people. You see what I'm saying? So Nat Measy said 6 9 is a part of uh, 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 LBA and black American culture. Get out of here, little nigga. Come on. Let's get it. Now, let's see. Don't nobody. Hey, thumb up this video. Let's see now. Now, look. Now, is this. African-American culture. I'm just being real. I used to listen to this shit too. You see what I'm saying? To I realize, you know, this shit is killing the people. And I'm going to show you that it is. The niggas always want to say, I don't want to blame hip-hop. Well, damn it, I'm blaming hip-hop. Nigga, I'm blaming the lyrics of hip-hop. You see what I'm saying? Whoever is out there paying them to rap like that. Now, let's see these statistics right here. Y'all see this chart right here, right? Okay. So... This is the demographics of the influence of rap and hip hop music on the uh, mind of African American children and African American spirit. Now look, uh, the blue is the dark blue is forty percent, which is physical violence. So forty percent of uh, what Nat Measy and Tariq Nasheed and, and uh, 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 O'Shea Duke Jackson says is a American history. 40% right there is physical violence on black people. The purple is date rape drugs and sexual assault, which is 15%. Uh, 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 the light blue, uh, uh, the same thing. Date rape, another 10%. Uh, sexual conquest, which is red, another 10%. Uh, Rape, sexual assault, all of the, the same thing. Another five percent. You see what I'm saying? Another uh, uh the pink, another five percent, which is the same thing. Demeaning language, which is another ten percent. And then the, the last one, which is the orange, is another five percent, which is uh, some more rape, sexual assault shit. You see what I'm saying? So if you listen to rap music. And you see, you know, the vibe, the physical violence that happens in the streets and you can't make the correlation with the two, there's something wrong with you. If you sitting around listening to a music that preach kill, 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 
Drugs, drugs, drugs. Rape, rape, rape. Bitch, hoe. All day. Then the, the type of mind that that's going to create is, you know, going to be a, 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 a black terminator. Program to kill black people. And, and program to, you know, demeaning language and shit and all of that type of shit. And that's what the facts right there. I don't want to hear nothing about hip hop. Well, I ain't going to blame the hip hop. I'm going to blame the shit right now. Get mad all you want, damn it. Now, look. Now, okay, there you go with the gangs and shit. Do that represent, you know, gangs and shit. Is that, you know, black American culture or what not? Because did they keep saying they got a We know for a fact that our culture was stolen by the European. There's no getting around this shit. You see where there's no getting around this shit. So the babies is facing a hell of a lot. So you know, ain't no praying. You best to, you know, be making preparations to get you and your children up off of this wicked land. Okay? And if you planning on staying, you best to get all the artillery you can get. You Subscribe to King Ja Power. Subscribe to the throne. Okay? Go over there to the throne and subscribe. He's going to pick them up and put them in a meat grinder and they're going to end up being served at the McDonald's dollar menu. Jop out. Be, be, king. Get free or die. Heavy is the head to wear the crown.